Well, hey, McFly subscribers, I've got a review for you. And it really, I mean, it kind of has to do with fly fishing and fly tying, but not really at the same time. It's actually on a desk lamp and actually a floor lamp as well. There's one right here. These two lamps are actually from a company called Taltronics, I believe. Let me see. Yeah, Tal <laughs> Taltronics is the name of the company. Um, I got these on Amazon a long time ago. In fact, well, I got this one on Amazon a long time ago. It's pretty old, quite dusty. Should have probably cleaned that off before I did the review. Uh, anyway, <laughs> this is a little newer. I got this a couple months back. Um, and I actually replaced the old one that I had. But this is what I've been using for a long time for my fly tying. What I like about it, it's got this kind of bendy arm that allows you to really position this anywhere you want it. Okay, so while fly tying, and it's high enough too because, I mean, even if you've got a, an arm that you tie with that's a little higher, um, this is just high enough for almost anything I've tied with to be able to get in really tight or, you know, further back so you're not in the way. And then I've got a desk one here, um, or I'm sorry, a floor one here, that's the desk, uh, a floor lamp from the same company. And they're all LED, by the way. I'm going to turn that off. There we go. Um, they're all LED. So, they don't get really hot. I mean, there's a little warmth to them, but they don't get really hot. And they're super duper bright. Um, let me turn that on. Blind you, but you can see there's tons of LEDs. Uh, you can also adjust the color. Okay. Which is nice. Because sometimes that really bright white is really hard on the eyes, so it's kind of nice having, you know, a little little less bright. Anyway, uh, these are the boxes they came in, and I'm not sponsored by them. They didn't even, I, I paid for these. They were on Amazon. Uh, the reason why I got them originally is this was only like in the $20 range. I think it's $22 maybe uh, now. It used to be $19, now it's $22, I think. It might be $24, might be $21. Boy, it's... Uh, it's been a couple months since I bought one. This one was in the $40 range uh, because it, you know, it's a desk or a floor one rather than a desk one. A little more to it. And I'll get some closer images of it and kind of everything so you guys can see. So this is the, the, the desk lamp. What I like is, so I'm going to turn off the lights, hopefully. I think you guys will be able to see it a little better. No, you won't. I'm going to bring this over. I want to show you. It's all touch. So there, you can adjust the color of this one by pressing this. And the same thing, you can see here, got a couple different... Um, get some light on that. A couple different, uh, I gotta use a flashlight here, but a couple different settings with the color. Okay, I've got auto white on my camera, so that might not be showing up too well on um, the different colors, but basically it goes from, you know, bright white to, you know, like a yellow kind of coloration. Uh, on this one, it's the same company, but they've got a different setting. On this one, it's not, here you can adjust how bright it is by that. So I'm going to turn this off and you can see it goes really low to really high. Okay. Um, on this one you adjust how bright it is by just hitting it. By tapping it there's four settings. Okay. Uh, to turn it off you just hold it down. Anyway, the reason why I'm reviewing this, guys, is because there's fly tying lamps out there. Because the, the issue is, I find that a lot of these lamps, like desk lamps, they're, they're not tall enough, okay? So if it's just a desk lamp and you're tying, you put it over top of your, your fly, um, they're, they're like this tall. And then it gets in your way and you can't tie and you're bumping it while, while trying to you know, tie on. And I like this because it you can really get it out of your way. You can put it anywhere you want. Um, it just kind of, you know, goes anywhere, kind of however you want it. I mean, sometimes while I'm time flies for video, I'll, I'll underlight it. I'll come in like this. 
and do an underlight and overlight so that way you know it's it's lit from all angles okay and you can just adjust it to wherever you want it and it just basically stays to wherever you put it um, both of these are the same but they both have this kind of neck on them uh, which is really nice so excuse the mess okay I'm gonna take you off up here excuse the mess under my desk here I haven't quite figured out there's my computer anyway um, so here's the the light and it yeah I mean it's you can make it really tall and it's just a floor Thing. Yes, I've got cords down there. I haven't fully fixed all this up. We did just move in and I just put, I mean, just move in. It's been about three months and I just got a desk maybe a month and a half ago and I, I just kind of put the, all this up. But I've been really busy, so I will clean down there, guys. But yeah, you can see and it, it's pretty stable. I mean, you know, I can, I can hit it pretty good and it comes back. Okay, I put my kid put that on there and I noticed that it helps keep it a little more stable, just a little more weight. Yeah, they use very little electricity. Um, and they're a good price. I mean, for $40 for a pretty nice uh, floor lamp, in reality, if you don't necessarily need it for fly tying, it's good for pretty much any use. I mean, just floor lamp, it gets pretty high. If you want something like, if you read somewhere, you know, um, and you just want something bendy that, you know, I mean, for 40 bucks, put it by your chair while you're reading. You know, you bring it in close to where you want it and read your books with the light there, you know, and that kind of thing. But I really like it for fly time. And that's kind of why I'm reviewing it is I've had a lot of people ask me, you know, what lights do you use for fly tying? And, and um, you know, especially being on camera, I've really got to get it bright. And these are super bright, but, you know, it's not, it's not blinding. Um, and if it's too bright for you, you can adjust... How bright it is, bring down the dimness to where it's not hurting your eyes if it is, or you can make it really bright. So, anyway, go check them out. I will put a link in the description section of the video of where you can buy it. I believe Amazon is the only place, so I have a link to the specific, to both of these specific lights on Amazon. Uh, they're a good deal, I think, and for me, they're, they're perfect for fly tying. Uh, it's what I use, and I'm not... You know, I just, I hate going and spending those specific lights strictly for fly tying. I mean, there is a hole here on this one that I could stick. They have specific lights just for it, but they're like 200 bucks or something crazy, maybe 100. I just remember they were way too expensive. And this works great for me. Um, that I don't need those expensive, ridiculously expensive fly tying specific lights. Uh, this is all I use for pictures, for video, for tying, for everything. Uh, they're just bright enough. And I like that you can adjust the the um, the color of the light, you know, uh, with them. And by the way, yes, I've got I've got a couple uh, saltwater flies here, so that might mean that I'm going saltwater fishing, guys. So at one point, you might see me down in the Gulf fishing, but uh, this is also a fly I might tie for camera here uh, in the next little bit. I might even tie some of these. They're kind of a special redfish crack in a way. Um, with some legs and all that, but anyway, um, that'll be coming up in maybe the near future. I'm not sure exactly when it is, but I know that I've got a trip coming soon, hopefully, if it works out and everything, um, that I'll be able to fish some redfish, so hopefully, hopefully I get some on the, in the Gulf, uh, redfish and sea trout, but anyway, that's coming up, but yeah, go check this out. These lights are, I like them a lot. I think for the money, they're great, so I've got a link. Make sure you use that link. Uh, helps me out. Anything that's sold through Amazon, um, I get a little percentage of it. That's not why I'm doing this video, but it does help. It helps uh, provide some extra income to the channel. But also, um, you guys know that you're getting the one that I got, so, you know, there, there it goes. Anyway, I will see you guys on the next video. Now you go catch some fish.